We're here live with Melody from Cafe Semino Country Inn in Sutton, West Virginia. We're going to take a little tour of one of the 101 unique places to dine in West Virginia as part of National Travel and Tourism Week. Melody? Welcome, West Virginia. Come on, I'm going to take a little walk. I'm going to show you a little bit about the property, okay? First off, we got the big house here. And uh, this is a, a, an old estate, uh, 1898. This home was built. But what a lot of people don't know, and I'm so happy to be doing this Periscope, is to show you that we got more than just the house. The house houses the restaurant and four of the guest rooms. But I wanna show you a little bit more. So we'll walk this way with me. We're right at the end of a cute little town, downtown Sutton. We got Cobblestone Street and the grounds here, if uh, he can show you here. And we're so happy to have GoToWV with us today. You have the grounds here when you come and stay. On the weekends, we do a fire pit here. Of course, today we're, we're uh, dancing between raindrops. We even have the Braxton County Monster. If we come a little further, we'll show you the Braxton County Monster chair here. And uh, that's become a hit. We'll go around and get the front of him, okay? And here we have the river. You can see the beautiful Elk River. This property is right on the Elk River. And we have 500 foot of uninterrupted access. You can throw your kayak or your canoe in. We encourage that. You can bring yours. We have two you can use when you're here as a guest. So here's the yard. So we'll just keep on walking. <laughs> and then you will see the carriage house. And this is the original carriage house from 1898. Of course, it's been remodeled quite a bit. But it has four guest rooms. And if you enjoy a porch, you can just sit out there on the porch, big old porch, and enjoy the view. He can maybe show you here the view. You look back at the main house, which is pretty awesome. We have parties on that uh, big white structure there. We haven't put the tent up yet because uh, we wait till May 1st. But we have parties there. And people just love the carriage house. There is a, a porch up there on the house, uh, one of the bedrooms. And we'll go look at that. We can go look at that right now if you'd like. Let's hurry. <laughs> so we um, we feel so honored. Uh, the readers polls of West Virginia living uh, readers have have said that we're the best B and B and have the best chef and, and best fine dining in West Virginia many years in a row. And this is my chance to say thank you, West Virginia, for that honor. We love it, but we need to see you. We need to see you often and soon. So plan your trip. We're even open Mother's Day weekend. You can come and enjoy Mother's Day. We're gonna have the West Virginia Hall of Fame garden party fundraiser here, Memorial Day. So if you wanna come and just have an outdoor garden party and wear a big floppy hat, come on and join us. Come on in, we'll see you inside. Yay, we are at 616 Main Street, Sutton, West Virginia. As you can see here, it's a rainy day, but on a sunny day, the porch is full. People love to eat outside, and if you're one of those people, you can ask for a table on the porch when you come. So we're going to sneak upstairs and look in the bedrooms, because we only have one guest tonight. So we are fine. When you enter, you see our four dining rooms. This is the limoncello room. You see it's yellow. We see, hi folks, <laughs> this is the eggplant room. You can see the deep purple. Did you know you were in the eggplant room? <laughs> <laughs> and I'm gonna look at the other rooms here before we go upstairs. This one has our lovely Jill, meat setting tables from an earlier, hi Jill. <laughs> this is our blueberry room. <laughs> and the next fourth dining room is called the Bordeaux. Not only for its color, but because it has wine in it. Hi, Jay. Hey. It's our one overnight guest tonight. Are you loving it? Loving it. Yay! Is, is he another guest? Um, th this he's from Go To WV, our tourism team in West Virginia, and he's letting people know about us, like oh. you are. Like oh, you please! Oh. If you want to hear a few me, come right over here. <laughs> oh yes, I just want to tell you is one of the most fa the most fanciest band breakfast I've ever been at. And she's certainly one of the most friendliest people I ever met. Oh, thank, you. thank you. And beautiful, too. Hey, that'll get you an extra uh, piece of ham at breakfast. Okay. <laughs> there you go. Just make a sausage. We're gonna, okay, we're going to sneak upstairs and we're going to look at some bedrooms. I 
Oh, you have to say hello to Sean. Everybody knows Sean. Hi, He's nice our to major see you. D here. Come back. Come and see us sometime. Yay! All of the silos. 1898, thank you. You can see all of the wood, all of the glass, the stained glass, and the fireplaces, and everything's original to 1898. So we're going to come in here, and of course these rooms are... This is called the Logan Room. All of our rooms are named after our grandchildren. And I'm going to turn a few lights on so you can enjoy. We have just authentic period stuff. We try to have enough room for you to have room for your things, not a whole lot of knickknacks, so you can use the space. This is a popular bathroom because it's got its own tub. And there's a unique story about this. This is where the crib to the family sat under the stained glass window. And everybody could run in and take care of the baby from all the rooms of the house open to this bedroom. But of course now it's turned into a bathroom. Isn't that neat? Awesome. All right. And we can, there we go. We're going to look at this room. This is the Annabella. There we go. I love this room because of the view. This looks out over the property. And it has a terrace. And we'll see that. Let's see. Come with me. Come with me. This is the one room in the house that offers this. And this it gives you a really a good view of the carriage house, which we just looked at. The fire pit on weekends. Oh, and the pond here is awesome. It's actually 1898, the goldfish pond with the fountain, and it's still operational. We were lucky, lucky recipient of some good caretakers. We feel privileged to be the, the caretakers of this. If you come this way, you can see a few more features. Of course, we talked about this, the white structure. We'll get a tent on it next week, and we have parties there. This cool little house was the servant's quarters for this estate. Actually, I think the, the neat irony of it is they're the most expensive rooms now, so the people who really did all the work to this property have the coolest, coolest rooms because they look right out on the river. And there are some balconies. We'll have to go check that out, too. There are two suites there. And if you look right there to the right is our outdoor brick pizza oven. Y'all may or may not know, but Chef Tim is from uh, Calabria, Italy, is his heritage. And everybody, they cook outside, cook in a brick oven. So that is a real pizza oven. And every Thursday, May through October, you can come here and get an authentic Italian margarita pizza. And we're getting some rain, so hallelujah. <laughs> May, April, May, May showers are going to bring June flowers. <laughs> Okay, now we gotta look at, come on through. This is the big, wow, b, b room. This is called the Julia. And you can see it's, a lot of people love this because of the giant bed. <laughs> it's got the big bed. Martha Stewart designed this bed. It's got a Martha Stewart bed, and it's a replica of an old 19, uh, 1898 design. Had a lot of fun outfitting this B&B &B and uh, we love it. What makes it come alive is all you people from West Virginia coming to it. We love it. I see the bathroom here. This was the master bathroom. This is 1898 tile. All of this. So incredible. Right? Authentic tile. And it's got another one of the big soaker tubs. And we get a pretty good view from here too. These beautiful pine trees everywhere. <laughs> so all you gotta do is you can go online to cafesaminocountryinn.com and make a reservation. You can always give me a holler on Instagram or out on Facebook. Again, that's Cafe Semino Country Inn. We make reservations all those ways. Thank you so much for the tour. You're welcome. And I can't wait to try some of the food. Now you're, you're going to get to eat. Yay! We're going to get to eat and we'll take some pictures and do some uh, 
maybe maybe a periscope of our meals. Awesome. We'll see how it works awesome. Out. Thank, you Thank you so again. much for coming here. We and love being and part of West Virginia Tourism Week. Go to WV. WV. Go to WV.